Welcome to another episode of Municipal Affairs. Last week, municipal leaders from across the province of Alberta gathered in Red Deer, Alberta for the annual Alberta Municipalities Convention and Trade Show. This event featured debates on resolutions, addresses from provincial party leaders, and insightful discussions on a wide range of topics shared among municipal officials. Now, we were there on the ground and had one key question for these municipal leaders. We asked numerous municipal councillors what the provincial-wide organization meant to their community. Attention Saskatchewan. This election season, Municipal Affairs is hitting the road in partnership with SUMA for the Saskatchewan provincial election. Join us on election night for live coverage straight from Regina, on YouTube, featuring exclusive insights from municipal leaders and stakeholders across the province. We will be capturing their reaction to the results and be diving into what the new provincial government means for municipalities. Plus, this fall, we will be traveling across Saskatchewan to hear directly from local leaders about the issues that matter most to you. Plus, this fall, we will be traveling across Saskatchewan starting September 30th to hear directly from local leaders like yourself about the issues that matter most. This is your election covered like never before. Municipal Affairs, your trusted voice from the grassroots to the government. I think it means advocacy. I think it means growth. Um, and I think it just means... Uh, bringing a human side to everything that we do because sometimes when you are in your tunnel and you're focused on your community you as an individual on council can get a little lost in all of that and this brings us back down I think it brings us all back down to who we are what we're doing why we're doing it and gives us a little bit of hope and a little bit of fuel to go forward for the next year uh, it means collaboration with all the other municipalities in the province and it means meeting new people and old friends that we've met before. Alberta municipalities is something that uh, I think is essential in order for a platform for uh, municipalities to actually be heard uh, and I couldn't be more proud that we're a member. One of the key wins of these sessions always is the resolution sessions. Um, when we come together as a group and determine what our priorities are to advocate to the province. So uh, as much as I do enjoy the, the networking, the chance to meet with the ministers, it's those resolution sessions that are really important to make sure that uh, the AMA is advocating with one voice. We also caught up with some mayors and asked them the exact same question. What the municipal organization, Alberta Municipalities, meant to them. Oh, um, I think it's, uh, it's good to have that provincial voice. Somebody that can lobby on behalf and, and like we put forward that motion to have uh, grants and places taxes re uh, replaced or uh, put back in place. So having a provincial body to lobby, if it's just high prairie lobbying, it doesn't have as much weight. Well, I'm a bit biased. <laughs> That's why I like asking the biased people. <laughs> I'm a little biased. Uh, this association um, not only is dear to my heart because I was inv involved for so long, but it really is for two reasons. It's a great place to get our messages and advocacy f from St. Albert to the province. But the other point is these conventions are great for networking, great for best practice sharing great for camaraderie and you know crying on each other's shoulders when we're having a bad day because politics can be rough. I think the biggest thing is that we're not alone so all of us are together and it doesn't matter what size you are or what your priorities are or what's happening we are all together and there's camaraderie in that but also advocacy and friendship in that too and and for me I always come back to the relational side of what's of what we do um, and it's the same in Alberta municipalities as it is in my own hometown. The building of relationships and making sure that we encourage one another, we walk with one another when it's hard times, we celebrate when it's good times, like Miss Anna from Wembley who won an award this year. Um, yeah, so, so all of those things, that's what Alberta municipalities to me is why it's so great is that it gives us the opportunity to do that officially <laughs> together. Um, and encourages us to keep going. You mean like the organization as a whole? Yeah. It's just really a, a great organization where we can connect, um, where we can 
collaborate. Um, and, you know, we know members of the board of directors. Uh, we work with the staff at Alberta Muni's on basically a daily basis. And so when issues arise, it's nice to be able to pick up the phone and have somebody there that can help you through some of those issues. Well, I appreciate what they do for us. I mean, it's it's nice to come to the convention uh, to uh, have a, you know the fellowship and, and uh, uh, learn from some of the other municipalities and find out that you know we're all in the same boat together. You know, we need to work together to to move this province forward, and you know we, we need each and every one of us. And so, you know, I, I think this is a, an organization that um, supports that philosophy and, and tries to bring it forward. And, and you know, I appreciate being able to come. It just means the education. It means uh, connecting and, and networking with uh, like-minded individuals and just kind of learning from each other, uh, sharing best practices so we can bring it back to our communities. Um, I always uh, have this phrase that when I talk to um, our councils and our administration and our residents, when we go out on strategic planning and conferences, it's like it's uh, easier for us to, you know, have a dinner with our MLAs or another municipality than it is for us to repeat the mistake of another municipality. So those are the big things that I always look forward to, is to uh, connect with uh, like-minded uh, municipalities like size and say, how are you addressing these things? And uh, let us have that conversation. Now, thanks for tuning in for another episode of Municipal Affairs. We hope you've enjoyed today's discussion with municipal leaders from across the province of Alberta. If you haven't already, be sure to hit that subscribe button so you never miss an upcoming episode. Your support helps us to continue to grow and bring you more important conversations and discussions like you heard today. So stay connected. Stay informed, and we'll see you next time here on Municipal Affairs.